They playing with me. It's too early to be playing with me. So I ended up in Walmart. I'll explain why when I get to the car. But they got some good deals. Look at these boots. Let me show y'all. These boots. And we can arrive the book and all right, you guys, so I'm back home. I made it back home a little while ago, probably like 45 minutes ago. And let me show you what I got. Although I might do a separate video, just uh, trying these on. I haven't decided. Am I? It's not much, but um, it could be like a short video, maybe a short, because it's only like three little outfits literally not like outfit outfits but like cozy loungewear so um like on my days off when i'm not going anywhere i'll be in the house just in my nightgown all all day and i feel like if somebody stopped by the house like i don't i shouldn't be in my nightgown so i'm like dang and i don't want to put on like an outfit outfit but i just want some comfortable cute loungewear that's acceptable like to just be lounging around all day and if somebody stopped by it's still acceptable for that so i found some stuff for that so i got these pants y'all these are lamp i think i they have to be loungewear but look they got the little bottom that's like cuffed like kind of like a jacket and the legs is like a sweater like a teddy bear sweater material y'all see that and then the pants it's like that uh, windbreaker type pants. The pocket is like that. And then they got the elastic like windbreaker uh, deal with the tie string. So I think that's cute. And it was on sale. It was regular $12.88 and it was on sale for $7. $7 boost. So hopefully that's cute whenever I put it on. Oh, I think the back has pockets. Oh, no, it don't. It don't. I thought it did, but it don't. Good. So that, and then I just got a shirt to go with it. Ooh, I'm gonna knock y'all over. My bad. The shirt is on top of there. Oh, I hope y'all don't fall now. I hope y'all don't fall now. Okay. There we go. Y'all are stable. But I got an olive green shirt to go with it. I'm hoping it will do right. I really wanted the spaghetti strap. Like on a video of me putting the Christmas tree up, how I had that spaghetti strap. It wasn't spaghetti strap. It was like a muscle shirt. It's a difference. I realized because in the store, I was trying to get some shirts in there, but I, which I already bought some thinking it was like the shirt that I wore on Chris, putting the Christmas tree up. It's not though. They're like really skinny straps and the back is like lower than I want. Like it'll show my back fat. I don't like that. I thought it was the same as that other shirt that I had, but the black shirt I have, I wish I could pull it out, but it's underneath some other clothes. But it's like a thicker um, muscle shirt instead of a spaghetti strap. It's like a muscle shirt, not spaghetti strap. Muscle shirt, because it's like a shirt with the thicker, it's thicker little straps and it covers like, it's like a regular shirt. It don't just be coming down low and your back's out. So. I, I don't have none of those right now in Walmart. So I don't know where I got that black one. I'm sure it was Walmart, but they don't have them. So I just got a regular shirt because I didn't want to wear them other ones. Although it would look perfect the front, but the back, no. It like shows my rolls, I believe, in the back. It like, like everything could show the rolls, but it shows it in like a unflattering way. Let me see. Is that a shirt? No, that's not it. So anyways, I got this regular shirt to go with it. Like tuck it in in there and wear it with it. We'll see. If I do the separate video, if it looks okay, we'll see. And then I got these like sweatpants. They're like gray. They got the little cuff bottom too. I actually got some just like this, but they don't have Snoopy. They're just like the Fruit of Looms. The Fruit of the Loom. I think that's what it's called. Fruit of the Loom type of pants. Sweatpants that's just plain with pockets and a drawstring. And I got two pairs of those actually. One fits good and one fits bigger. Which is still both comfy. But I said I want these because they got Snoopy. And I think it'll fit even better. Like more cuter. That's the back. Here's the front. And it got the drawstring. 
Snoopy on the side, and then the little bottom is the cuff bottom. So yeah, that's that. And with that, I got, um, I didn't get a shirt for that because I got, I'm gonna wear that black spaghetti, not spaghetti, that black muscle shirt I'm talking about. I'm gonna wear that with that one. I wanted a yellow shirt to go with that because Snoopy, the little bird, I don't know that bird's name, but the little bird, I wanted a yellow one, but they didn't have a yellow to match this. They had yellow, but it was like a different type of yellow. All right, and then I got this to wear, just leggings to wear out. Yes, I wear stuff with flowers. Just yesterday I had some on with leggings with flowers. Y'all seen me on before I play? I don't remember, but my other vlog when I was at Discount Tire, I had some leggings that had the little flowers. Not, they weren't big like this, but they were smaller flowers. I wore it yesterday too. They're dirty, so I can't show y'all, but yeah, these are big sunflowers, so it draws a lot of attention. <laughs> but I will wear this. Uh, just casual because like today I got this sweater on oh y'all probably see I got stained I dropped some tea on it yeah tea leaked out of the cup and went on my whatever I was done anyways I just need to stop and get gas so nobody saw me really but I dropped some y'all can't probably see it on here y'all probably can but anyways I got the sweater on and I got some leggings on with this my um leopard leggings so these are cheap and comfortable and just easy to throw together and cute so I got some um some of these. <laughs> Ooh, this is really standoutish. I'm questioning wearing these out or just around the house because they are pretty, pretty eye catchy. <laughs> but hey, whatever is cute. This and I just got the black top to go with it. Another black shirt. Cause y'all know whenever I get off of my full time and I got DoorDash I usually pack that black shirt like that but it's faded because I had it for years pack that black shirt and some type of tights that match with it either the camouflage these leopard ones or either just a black pair and I'll throw that faded black shirt with it but since these are new leggings and they dark black I couldn't wear that faded shirt with it I mean I could but it just wouldn't really look too cute so i just got the real a new black shirt to go with it so if i don't try it on on this blog i will do a separate little quick it's probably a short because it's only like three outfits so i'll probably just do a short a little short video you know the videos on youtube just called shorts yeah it'll turn into a short because it's so short um yeah so that's the clothes I got from there. And then I got other little stuff y'all saw in the car. I got that. Got me some tire cleaner. This brand is so good. Um I don't know how to I don't know how to pronounce that name, but this one, the hot shine. I think this is the same one I had. I used to have it sitting right here, but I sprayed my tires, I think, the other week. So I don't know where I put that. Maybe in my trunk. No, it ain't in my trunk. I don't know, but I hope I got the same. It's this brand, but I hope that I got the same type. I think it's the same, but it worked good entirely. Black and shiny. Oh, I need to go spray it on there now because I washed my car yesterday. Um, Got some more hand lotion because I needed it at the moment. Although I got some. I got some for Christmas. I bought myself a little set, which is in the background. But and underneath all that mail and stuff, I got a little box with hand cream. So I got hand cream. I got some in my backpack for work. But I didn't have any with me in the store. I even had some in my door in the car. But I need a refill anyway, so that one's running low. But I have all kinds here that I can refill, but I needed it. I really needed it in the store. I'm obsessed with buying this because why did I get this? I don't need this. I don't need it. I needed it in the store because I went to the bathroom and I washed my hands and they got ashy immediately. They turned white. I was like, oh, where's the lotion? People can't see me like this. But that's why I bought it. But do I need it? No, I don't. I got like five, six, seven containers. Yeah. Well, we got eight. So that and I got, ooh, mm, mm, mm. I got a foot mask or feet mask. Uh, it says, oh, flirty. I thought it said filthy. <laughs> 
Okay, flirty feet, moisturizing and smoothing foot mask. I got this, and I wanna. I plan on probably doing a um, a pampering, relax, relaxing uh, day for me and uh, doing a video on that. And I believe I'm gonna incorporate my feet in there cause I need a pampering from head to toe day. You know what I'm saying? We need that. Every now and then we need that. And I need the reset. I needed to do it last week, but I didn't. So I need to do it this week. And I wanna incorporate this mask, it's a foot mask. And I want, I didn't get this at Walmart, but my homeboy gave me this. I have it out because I was pairing it together because whenever I do my pampering day, I'm going to do the face mask and the foot mask, boo. We're going to begin nice and smooth, nice and smooth. And, oh, I got the boots that I have on my foot. I'm trying them on. But those boots that I got on sale, y'all, for $7. And they were originally $30. I got them for $7. Look like little Doc Martin. These boots. Can y'all see them? Uh, okay. You can't. Let me take it off. You can see them if I put my foot up there. Yeah, I see them right there. Let me take it off though. Okay, so here it is. Look at that good sole. Look how thick that is. And look at the stitching. I mean, you can't tell me these ain't no Doc Martens. Y'all, Doc Martens was popular when I was in school, junior high and high school. <laughs> It Doc Martens was a popular thing. I used to always want a pair, but they were so expensive. I definitely we couldn't afford them. So I never got a pair. But these look like Doc Martens. That's crazy because all the Doc Martens have them thick soles like this with kind of the same type of print. And then it always had that stitching. Girl, now I finally got me some Doc Martens. And I'm 35 years old. This ain't Doc Martens though, so I still ain't got no Doc Martens. Still ain't got no money for no Doc Martens. This is the, what what can we call these? Not Doc Martens, but Doc Marks. <laughs> Marks, not Martin, but Mark. This is my Doc Marks. <laughs> So yeah, I got the zipper, but it's Madden, Madden NYC. Like I said, I really believe it's a brand of, I think Steve Madden make these, but it's like the cheaper type of brand, the cheaper material, the cheaper material, I should say. So yeah, I got that and I got a couple things for my mama. I got her a little nightgown. I should show y'all. Let me get that nightgown. It's a cute nightgown. I wanted it for myself, but I said, I'm gonna give my mama a nightgown. Got a nightgown. Then I got some, some carpet cleaner stuff. So. But let me get that nightgown. I'll be right back, y'all. Huh. All right. Here's the here. I said candle. I'm saying candle because when I walk back in my room, I smelled this candle. It smells so good. That candle I had got from TJ Maxx. It's sage or something. Sage and pumpkin. I got it around fall time, but I just be burning all kind of other candles. Put that to the side. Why did I do that? I started burning it again this morning, and now I just relit it. It smells good instantly. It smells so good. But anyways, this is the nightgown. It says, um, a day without coffee is like, just kidding. I have no idea. <laughs> That is so cute. And then the coffee just says hot and fresh. That is so cute, little boo-boo. So it's the long uh, one. It looks almost just like my uh, Aloha one I be wearing all the time. Y'all see, I be seeing it on the videos. It looks like that. And it even has pockets. I forgot to tell my mama I got pockets. I'm gonna tell her. Ah, again with pockets, a plus in the books. Okay, y'all, and that's all. There is something else I want to tell y'all. I got, I didn't go to the Dollar Tree today, but I went yesterday. I got two books. Let me show you. Where's the other one? Y'all, excuse my mess. My dresser looks horrible. And it's always like this, because I just feel like all that stuff needs to be there. I don't know where else to put it. 
I need it. My perfume and stuff right there. I need that. I need my perfumes. They gotta be there. My candles. I burn my candles right there. Here's my perfume set from Christmas Versace right here. Need that. Got my MAC lipstick up here. Got my flowers from my dudes. Okay, I saved my flowers. These are from three different dudes up here. These dry flowers right here is from my latest boo. A few years ago, he gave me these for Valentine's Day. Saved them ever since. Um, I say my latest boo, but we're not together right now. But he's the latest one I've been with. <laughs> he's my latest significant other that I've had. So those are for him. The ones in the corner over here behind the fake flowers right here. Those are from my ex-boyfriend from we stopped being together in like 2015 those were the first flowers he ever gave me which was in 2012 2012 he gave me those they're dry and i put them there i actually got a picture of when they were fresh and new it's a picture on the front there but i'm not gonna get that because it's too much junk over there but yeah those are from him these are from my recent boo and then the ones back here uh you can't even see them but they're actually right over here some more dry roses those are from this other dude who i used to talk to who i cannot stand and i usually never like hate the guys i've been with but him i like hate him i hate him but those are from him yeah my sister angela she's watching she knows exactly who i'm talking about I hate him. Yeah, him. Um, and then the other ones over here, the little, it's just two little roses with baby breath. Those are from my ex who gave me those over here. He gave me those two um, on a different occasion. Probably just to give me that. He was a sweetheart. He was very sweet, respectful, and he would just give me stuff to give me stuff. He was awesome. He was just what every woman would want in a man. And we're not together. It ain't nothing that I did. It's other stuff that was going on with him. Not the typical that you would think. Not cheating or anything like that. He didn't do that. It's some other stuff. That probably would have to be a story time. But I'm not for sure. Because I kind of don't want to mention that. Kind of personal. So so anyways. But he was awesome. He was awesome. He was a great dude. So anyways. That's that junk back there. But anyways. What I was trying to say is. You see how off track I get. I was trying to say I went to the Dollar Tree yesterday and got two new books because I had got a cookbook for Christmas that had awesome stuff in it. Every last thing in it I wanted to make. Like, I, I never had a cookbook where every page was good to me. Like, everything was good. It's always like here and there it might be good stuff. All the rest is like, what is that? Like, I'm not going to eat that. Well, that book was great. So, I got some more. I got this low-carb cookbook. Low-carb low carb favorites and it got some pretty good stuff in it although i don't think everything in it is not something that i want i just skimmed through it yesterday so um some stuff in it i don't want and then i got this one cook out cook out made simple and it has a lot of little stuff you would have like for a cookout so yeah it got sauces look it got that sauce that greek like sauce our mediterranean type sauce that you have with like um that stuff what you call it Shar sharma chicken it's in here it's in here too a recipe for that they got different stuff it's just yum <laughs> yummy stuff y'all look they even got some chicken wings over there chicken wings in that bad boy so yeah don't sleep on a dollar tree they be having some good little books they have good books to read good cookbooks like cookbooks is like stuff you would really want to eat for real so please don't fall girl that stack be sliding and falling and dripping and dipping yeah so anyways i'll talk long enough um i don't know what i'm about to do I, oh i think i'm probably gonna do the video for these clothes maybe maybe i don't know um so but anyways just want to show y'all what I got from Wally World. Wow, wow, Mark. Wow, wow, Mark. All right. Hello.